I am Debbie and Louise it's from it's Lancaster, South Manchester. I am a cancer survivor, colon cancer. I had stage 3 colon cancer. I did surgery last year before me. I'm still wearing a colostomy bag on my side. And because I lack a family support and the child that is not taking care of her and she's a serious child, she's also speech and cognitive delay. So I'm sending her to school at NCU where they have special program for her. So government is helping me to pay $30,000 a night to find 35. And right now I don't have no one to help me to pay the school fee. So I'm looking support and assistance as a sick person, taking care of myself and my child. I walk and sell a little stuff on the town. So because I swell up, it just come out on the weekend. Okay. So your daughter is how old, mom? She's six years old. And she's been suffering from seizures from? Seizures from, from she, nine months. Okay. Nine months. And she's speech and cognitive delay. She, so she's not doing much talking. She's trying to make one and two words now. But as a little improvement, as a little day goes by, mm -hmm. you know, I have to know her sign language. I have to know when she wants to go to the bathroom. She cannot do anything for herself. So in the night, I put on pampers. She don't like the pull-ups. But I use the pampers and put it on for her. Because just last year, when I sent her to NCU, September, so it's just one year now since I get her out of the campus. One year, so she's five year old. I get her out because I couldn't understand no right. her out. So right. I didn't send her there. So because of that, I decided to continue to send her there. So I'm looking for support. So she's been going for a year now? Yeah, she's, she dropped out of school January. She hasn't been to no school from January. So I just September I'm trying to get her back because of lack of father support. And you know, father was supporting and just cut her off. Okay. So because of that, she hasn't been to school from January. So I'm trying to make sure she up back. September. No family support, no mother, no brother, no sister, no father, just me and the Almighty as a person carrying the through the sick person, which we are in a colostomy bag at my side to help take care of my child. So I'm with kindly for your support for the back to school. It is not too late, school will be open Monday, but people I'm asking a grateful for your support and can help to donate towards our school fee because I also have to even go and pay a shadow because I don't have a full spot total, but I'm not going to beg a shadow up by the school to just assist her while we just give her something. So be grateful for your support, Miss Chanchan, if you can help me. And God will continue to bless you. And in the future, when I be better, may God can help me also that I can come back and do the same thing to help people like myself and others that don't have it. Because that is my dream and desire to come out like Miss Chanchan one day and help people. So we am grateful and many, many blessings. And God continually to bless Miss Chanchan and ex her continually broad and wide and I'm asking people also repent repent for God is coming God bless you okay so your daughter is how old mom? she's six years old beautiful little girl what's her name remind me of her name again? Franz Branesca Franz, Franz Branesca Franz <laughs> Branesca <laughs> oh, okay. all right so you heard her story if anyone out there can reach out to mommy on behalf of her daughter Franz Bernesca, she's just asking for a fair chance to get a good education. So if anybody can help, you can reach out to me and I'll reach out to mommy. Alright? Um yeah, for the for the cancer, the doctor a few more polyps in the colon. So I'll be wearing the colostomy bag from two and a half years from the virus, but I did the surgery last year, the fit for me. So they cut from the piece of the colon and they removed the cancer tumor. But they want me to take some radiation right now before the bag can remove. So I don't have an okay by myself. It's just me and the Almighty and the doctors now to determine which when this bag will be removed. So by faith, I'm hoping by faith. So I'm going back to KPH at my appointment here and I will continue at my next surprise. It's UC University Hospital. I did surgery. Okay. Yes. So you know it's expensive out here. Every visit is a you know, cost. So I'm not worrying about to remove it. God will provide any time when I reach there. So I'm going back to KPH now to sort out the radiation. I did a CT scan and it come out spontaneous without cancer. So I'm hoping now I did an MRI now. So I'm going back. I don't know what's the result of the MRI until I get back to my appointment. So from there, I will know if I have any more cancer. But I okay. know what I'm by faith I'm speaking it because the CT scan shows spontaneous, so that means I have none. And by the Almighty God, I have no more chances, so I will be normal by faith. So I just continue to pray for me, and I will trust in God. So if I decide that I'm going to get the radiation, yes or no, God knows my mind and his mindset and everything. So I just leave everything in God's hands. 
for God to take care of me, so bless up. Yes, yes, yes. Wow. Franz Bernesca, here's a little dolly for you. Thank you. She Thank like you. dolls. Yes. So you see how she, she yes. You see yes. how she hands with the doll? Yes. 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 See the, the dolly yes, yes, have she have a phobia of new things mm -hmm. because she even when dolly I have wings, new shoes have to see? hold her. Yeah. Dolly yes. can fly. Yeah, she she. Okay. Yeah, even when I take her to the store to buy her shoes, sometimes I have to get somebody to hold her to put okay. on the shoes. Yes, mm -hmm. so she have a phobia. Okay. So that's it guys, if you can help this mom, please reach out to me and I will give you her contact details or if you wish to donate through me, you can do so. Thank you guys so much for watching and thanks for making it Shan Zen Zen Jamaican Vibes. Until next time, walk good and look out for your neighbor.